going to try your luck. Test me in the game. Oh, Let it rain. Please don't start us up. Got that black and white. They ain't in game. Mr. Officer, please don't search us. We don't got a thing. Tell her park it up. Then that be coming up. 24 Olympians are going to compete in the Tier Pro Series meet in Fort Lauderdale, Florida, and today, I'm going to get to go. But, like with many of my old college classes, I am running astronomically late, so I need to run. I honestly have no idea what to expect, because I've never been to a Pro Series meet, and even better is I looked on YouTube for like a Pro Series vlog, and there's been none. So this might be the first Pro Series vlog ever, besides from the Olympians, of course. Those are the only ones that came up. I forgot to mention that this competition is at the Hall of Fame pool, and it's right across from the beach. Look at this place. Really nice. It's been a while since I've been at this pool here. Last time I was here, I was racing, and it's weird to see that they're actually having like pro meets here now. And this is after like two years of renovation. I'm trying to see if I spot any Olympians here. I haven't yet. Well, it took about five seconds, but found an Olympian. Katie Ledecky's about to go up. I think that's her. As well as seeing the races, my goal is also to try and meet some Olympians. Katie's swimming the 200 fly. Never seen her do this race before, so let's see it right now. Coming from a background of competitive swimming, a lot of these Olympians have been inspirations to me in my own career, so it's awesome to get to see them compete. Our time in the world so far this year belongs to Katie Grimes, who saw the 1500 last night, 2958, that time. And hopefully I'll get to meet Katie later today. Then I noticed a swimmer and a coach from my alma mater, FAU. Hey, FAU! Let's go, man. Hey, I met you before. Um, I met you one time you came and swam with my team at BRST. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. David. How's everything? It's a great time to be in Iowa as the men's basketball team made it to the Final Four for the first time in school history, and now I'm getting to see one of their swimmers compete in a pro meet like this. Also, that swimmer I talked to ended up beating my friend Cam's FSU teammate in the 200 fly. Go Owls and take that, Cam. <laughs> Just kidding. I stumbled upon my first opportunity to meet an Olympian. Colin! Yeah. How are you doing, man? Hey, you? Colin Jones, four-time Olympic medalist for Team USA and a huge part to the world record relay. Hey, guys, thanks, man. You got hey, it. you mind being my video real quick? Sure. Guys, we're with Colin Jones here. What's your best tip for an upcoming swimmer, someone who's maybe in high school? Ooh, in high school. Definitely work on the kick. I'm seeing so many swimmers now. I'm, I'm doing a little coaching on the side. Yeah. You do not emphasize the kick. Yeah. Work on it. Work on both sides of the kick. Right. Yeah, man. Have a good one. Have a good Thanks. one. We got Regan Smith over here. She was the world record holder for the backstroke events, and she's getting ready to race now. It's also very different to see so many cameras and media people at a swim meet, but it's great because it's going to help grow the sport. I just noticed another update they made to this pool. This building back here it used to be all open and teams used to sit up there during the meets. Now it's all closed off, I guess, for the Olympians and maybe they have like offices up there like during the day. Regan Smith is destroying the field right now. She flip turned way before anybody else is even at like the flags. That's pretty crazy to see someone hold that speed for a long distance of a 400 freestyle like today. Pretty impressive lead built by Regan Smith. She's all lonely out there. <laughs> Sometimes you gotta be lonely to be at the top. Two winner, Reagan Smith. She's gonna touch it on 41327. Like, just look how long it takes the rest of her competitors to finish the race. Insane. Also, in case it looks kind of empty down here, there is a crowd behind me up here in the stands, so it is a pretty good event so far. At this meet, we have so many teams. We have teams from like Yale, Ohio State, Puerto Rico. We got Team Puerto Rico in the house here! Yes, Yale! Good luck, man. We got Olympian, Skater, Swim Club, etc. It's a very well diverse meet. People are flying in from across the country and all that type of stuff, so it's really exciting to see all these different pros here. That's Sharpie. Yeah. At first I was like, that looks like a weird set. <laughs> yeah, it's it's her uh, team symbol, so. That's cool. And here's a good opportunity to meet one of the best Kitty. Olympians in history. I couldn't read the poster from far, but this is so cute. How are you? Did you enjoy prelims? Yeah. Do you want to take a picture? Katie Ledecky, 10 time Olympic medalist and the most dominant women's distance swimmer in history. I think I'm gonna have the Olympic swimming perfect. Oh, yes! Oh my god, yeah! Okay. Okay. 
was looking at it when I showed her that she liked I it. it. And then she oh, saw your happy birthday come through and she was like, Whoa! Oh, that was the cutest thing. That cake was delicious. It was good. Good. so yummy. Did you have a good birthday party? Yeah. This was a cool moment between Katie and the young fan as she signed her cap and I realized how unprepared I was for an opportunity like this. So I rummaged through my bag and tried to get anything that was able to be signed. I came across the sunscreen bottle and I was like, it'd be kind of funny to get this signed, right? Thank you. Want to take a picture much. real quick? Sure, sure. Unfortunately, yeah, sure. I did not get around to asking her to sign and you it mind because she had to get going. My YouTube video? Uh, I gotta get going. No, Sorry. okay. Alright. But the sunscreen bottle saga will live on. The men's 400 freestyle is up with a couple stack oh. keys containing Olympic swimmers, Kieran Smith and Bobby Finn. Wow, they are in the three minute range for this race. Come on now. That's really, really fast. What up, Jay? You mind taking a picture? I got to meet and take doing? pictures with some awesome Good. Olympians and... Now I want to give you the weirdest request to sign something. Do you mind signing this sunscreen sure. bottle? Sure, yeah. <laughs> nice. <laughs> There you go. Thank you. I wasn't as prepared. <laughs> <laughs> I got you. I got you, bro. Thank you. That is probably the weirdest. Have one. a good one. Really? Yep, you too. Awesome. I've tried some foreheads before, but that was that was. Good. <laughs> you have Gator gear. Was that Kieran Smith who walked out? Lost complete sight of Kieran Smith. Don't know how because he is like six five. But okay. I'm gonna try to meet him tomorrow. All right. Got it. That's a wrap on day one of the tier pro series meet here at the Hall of Fame pool. I ended up meeting five Olympians and got three of them to sign this the sunscreen bottle because I was not prepared. Stay tuned for day two. Unfortunately, I won't be able to go to finals today or tomorrow, but I will be going on Saturday. On Saturday, they also have an autograph session by Katie Ledecky and another Olympian that's after the session, but we already met her, so that's a good thing. So I just got back to my car and I just realized I still have an hour or more of parking. I haven't been to the beach in a while, so we're gonna take advantage of that today. <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> The guy walked up to me while I was on there and he says, I hope to be as tall as you one day, bro. <laughs> Using the one that got autographed. I'm in a big need of a tan. Whew, my hair is a mess. Oh shit. This autograph got smeared by my thumb. Oh well, I'll try to bring some pictures tomorrow to get signed instead. It is so nice out today, but we have to get back to Boca because I need to work out. And that's part of a different challenge. If you've been following me on my Instagram, I've been posting, I've been working out every day for 365 days and we're on day 11 right now. Actually, I might be able to do my workout here. Day two of the meet, I assume that a lot of you guys viewing this are not swimmers and haven't been to a swim meet. So I figured to bring someone who has never been to a swim meet and Boy. He's gonna experience it today. Well, I have when I was a little kid. Future David, edit that part out. <laughs> Give myself more credibility than that. Into the Hall of Fame pool we go to so see some fast swimming and meet some more Olympians. What's up, Michael? How you doing? Good, you? Good. Do you mind signing later? Yeah. Cool. That's and then, it. And then this is your pictures, right? Yeah, don't press it. Okay. How you doing? Good. Good. How are you? Real quick, I got the freaking fly in like five minutes. Oh, okay. I got gotcha. you. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. Have a good one. I was not expecting him to come up right then. <laughs> <laughs> one Olympian on the day, we met Michael Andrews, super nice guy. He came over right after he was warming up and signed real quick for us before his race. So that was pretty cool. And luckily, I was filming here on the GoPro. Lily King, five time Olympic medalist, and she looked like she was done warming up. Might as well ask her to sign, right? Lily! You mind signing? Okay. Oh well, at least she waved. Maybe later. She's like, no, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> and there's Michael. Looks like we gave him some good luck beforehand because he is crushing it. There's no way Michael Andrew goes two for two, is there? 23-25, we're gonna tie atop the leaderboard. And just like that, he came so close to setting a pro series record. Olympians are everywhere at this meet, and I noticed one of them in the bleachers above us, so I had to go and meet her. How are you doing? Oh, I'm sorry. No, you're good. I was gonna ask, are you, uh, any laser? Yeah. Nice to meet you, I'm David. Hi. You mind being in my YouTube video real quick? Uh, you know what, not right now. Okay. No worries. She was kind of busy, but it's okay because I saw another Olympian who is actually one of the huge inspirations for me starting this YouTube channel, Cody Miller. Cody! Mind signing in a minute? How you doing, Cody? Mind signing these? Oh, dude, you're prepared. Yeah, man. 
Well, yesterday I wasn't, and I had some of the Olympians sign a, a sunscreen bottle, and it didn't work out too well. Thank you. Thank you. And make sure to stay till the end of the video for a special surprise from the Olympic swimmers. The most useless job in the world, lifeguarding at an Olympic swim competition. She looks <laughs> miserable, man. She's, I mean, yeah, she's, 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 she knows she well, she's, like she's bored. There's nothing to do. Aral, what do you think of your first swim meet so far? Uh, well, pro swim meet. Well, yeah. Um, I need to get in shape. <laughs> I do, too. I do too. I do too. That's man. it. That's, That's why it. I'm doing the challenge. 365 days straight. This is a perfect place to get motivation for that, right? Exactly. Hey, you mind taking a picture real quick? Also, you mind being my video real quick? Okay. All right. Um, yes. Okay. So, what's your best advice for a swimmer who's upcoming, maybe in high school or college? Just try to enjoy it. That's the most important. Thanks, man. Have a good no one. problem. Have a good one. I think that was a different guy than who I thought it was. Yeah. I wasn't expecting the yeah. accent. Yeah, there you go. I right. thought it was like the American swimmer who retired recently who was the breaststroker. No, man. <laughs> That's a bunch of oh, geez. Okay. Anyway, we got good advice anyway. That's a good turning point for the story. Going Olympian, 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 and then someone random you don't know. Jay Litherland just won his race. It's gotta be because of the good luck I gave him yesterday. No, I'm just kidding. Also, there's Olympians that I had no idea are here. Ryan Murphy, who was a world record holder and Olympic gold medalist, and he's here about to race. 200 back is a tough race, man. That's why I never did it. <laughs> Have you done it? Uh, 200 backstroke? Uh, wasn't the best, so I'll say that. Yeah. I get water in my ears, man. I mean, that's bugging me. I think I've only done it once in short course, and that was about it. But long course, I don't think I've ever done it besides in a practice. Kieran, how you doing, man? Good. You mind signing real quick? For who? Uh, for me. Do you have a different color? Uh, no, you could do maybe across the white and then it kind of goes over good with the faded. I feel like most people quit swimming because they get water in their ears. Because they get That's water in their the ears? Reason. That's not the main or reason they get why fat. I quit. Either or. They either get fat or they get water in their ears. Get out of here. Hey, I mean, I'm speaking from experience. <laughs> water in the ears first, though, I see, is the primary. Yep. I did not know he was going to be at this meet, so I ran over to the team store to buy a swim cap for him to sign. Yesterday, I just got a... I had nothing prepared, so I got a sunscreen bottle signed. <laughs> In the meantime, I figured I might as well try and go get Katie Ledecky to sign, as I came more prepared this time. Katie, when you're done, you mind signing? Thank you. Yes? So sure. How are you doing? I got, yep, right here. Got three pictures. Uh, if you don't mind signing them. Uh, it's David for this one. Yep, this one to David. I got two more for my sisters. What are their names? Gabriella. Thank you so much. Have a good one. Yeah, I like Katie. Got it? Yeah. Oh, good. Yeah, she's not gonna get blamed for it. Okay, good. There we go. They both fell down. Oh. Yeah, and, you know, I thought I was going to get played. I'm like, screw this one up. Nah, I saw it. I saw it happen. I turned around. I was like, what? Heading back to the other side, I wanted to get Jay Litherland to sign a picture because the sunscreen bottle didn't really work so well. But then I saw another familiar face. Ryan Held. Ryan, how you doing, man? Good. Good, Good. to see you. Uh, uh, I got something for him actually. Oh wait, yeah, I got you on this cap. Jay, could you sign these pictures? You can sign there real quick. Yeah. There ones. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, right here. <laughs> yeah, the sunscreen bottle didn't work very well. <laughs> all good, all good. It stayed all good, and then later on I went toward the beach, I went to spray it on me, and my thumb went over the signature. <laughs> <laughs> the only way he could have seen that is if he saw my Instagram story that I tagged him in, which you guys should go follow. All right, this is our all OT on vlogs now. Forget David Gens. This is my game now. <laughs> How you doing, Bobby? Hey. Mind signing these pictures real quick? Oh, yeah, sure. Thanks. The sunscreen bottle didn't really work though. Uh, <laughs> anyway? Uh, here's good. Thanks, man. Have a good one. No problem. You too. Good luck tonight. 
Um, You're welcome. Yep, time to go. Day two of the meet complete. What was your thoughts on it? What's your first time at a Pro Series meet like? Uh, everyone was in shape. I needed to get in shape. Uh, other than that, it was awesome. Dude, it was hot. I got a nice little tan. I like it. The weather's nice. Day three tomorrow. Very hot day today. So today, we're going to 7-Eleven. I need a Slurpee. And he needs energy drinks. Yeah. How many hours of sleep are you on? Uh, I don't even know. Like three, four. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I got seed in my throat. <laughs> Detour. Stepping on the beach. Stepping on the beach. Stepping on the beach. Oh, fuck. I got seed in my feet. Day three, we'll be at the final session, and things are going to get crazy. So stay tuned. Day three of the Tier Pro Series meet, and today, I got my family with me. You guys ready? Yeah. Gabby, you ready to be deck signed into a pro series meet? No. <laughs> After two years of no training. Absolutely no training, and she's gonna go compete with Olympians. I would sink. She would win. <laughs> Michael Andrew came over, and he took a ton of photos with fans and signed autographs. He was really nice to everyone, and I got my autographs yesterday from him, but I forgot to take a picture, so luckily I got that with him today. The crowd is forming over here for Michael Andrew. Luckily, I got him to sign two pictures yesterday, and then I just got one with him today. And we got to meet Regan Smith, who's one of the world record holders. Oh, uh, you can sign there. Yeah, Regan Smith. Yep, she just finished warming down. Things should probably walked over that way. Yeah. It was really funny seeing all these fans freak out when Olympians do something as simple as look at them. <laughs> Since it's finals, the crowd is much bigger, and along with the bigger crowd comes much faster swims as they take finals way more seriously and show up. A final of the women's 100 meters backstroke. Olivia Smoliga in lane three, her teammate. We've been shouting distance, but Smith out at a 27.82. The world champion, Reagan Smith, down the back stretch she goes. Look at make it three for three in the back stroke. Reagan Smith under the flags, into the wall, and she will touch at 57.92. Wow. Reagan Smith breaks. I definitely gave her good luck on that one. She broke the Pro Series record. Hell yeah. As well as the Pro Series record, she was .47 off the world record. That's crazy to see. Gabby just pointed out something really funny. So if you watch the officials on the right side, they're all like completely in sync. Like every way they stand and stuff, and when they walk out, it's so funny. It's so crazy. Like I just saw it when she said it, and they all turn at the same time, stepped off at the same time, and walked down to their chair as well. They're all NPCs. I gave her the good luck because she signed my pictures. Toward the end of the races is when the Olympians will come out and interact with the crowd. Like Kieran Smith right here. Hi, how are you doing? Good. Mind signing there real quick? Sure. Thank you. Oh, right here. There you go. Thank you so much. Can I take it? Can you send me no, I can't. No, I, I see it. It's right here. But I will not. Oh my gosh. Kieran, you could you could bend the rules a little bit. Who is that? Up top. Um, that's uh, Oh, fine, if she did it, I'll be. 
<laughs> Michael Andre is truly a man of the people. After a race, the swimmer typically just goes straight to warm down. But directly after his race, he walked over to do autographs and pictures for a huge crowd. <laughs> you could tell he was exhausted, but he was nice with everyone anyway. Then came a whole flurry of activity. I got to meet Olympic coach Greg Troy. Pleasure to meet you. Ryan Held came over again. On the picture? Okay. Yeah, sorry about that. And I finally got to meet Ryan Murphy. To the kid Leo I met, if you see this, I hate to tell you, man, but Ryan Murphy's about to come here, and you left like literally two minutes before he came over. What's up, Ryan? How you doing, man? You mind signing real quick? Thank you. Those two pictures on the right. Yeah. On them or? Uh, if you could sign in the white and then maybe just across you there. Yeah, on the picture. On the picture. Thank you, man. I just there. And to the guy Leo I met here, I'm sorry to let you know that Ryan Murphy came like a minute after you left, so it was kind of poor timing. Hey, shout yourself out, man. Thanks, man. <laughs> He wanted a shout out in the video earlier and I forgot to give it to him. Oh, can I get it? Can I get it? Dude, you will never believe what happened. Ryan Murphy came like a minute you after got you it? left. Yeah. Oh my god. Dude, it was crazy. Oh, and this is the guy Leo I mentioned, by the way. Yo, what's up? <laughs> Natalie Hunt signed, and then there was this funny moment that happened right in front of me. Man, this is so upsetting. Why would you go? I told him right here too, but now he just has to go right on top of Katie with like a signature. Okay. Like my sunscreen bottle thing, this girl asked the Olympians to sign a Chipotle bowl. You're gonna be the bad guy here, Simone would stay all night if, if, if we let her. Where's she going? She's got places to go and people to see. Y'all gotta have markers. Okay. Yep. Someone in y'all. Legend. Alright, turn around, smile, Ella. Thank you so much. You. How you doing, Simone? Mind signing in the bottom there? Mind Simone Manuel was the last to sign, but you might have noticed that earlier in the video, I asked Colin Jones for his best piece of advice for swimmers. Well, I actually asked that same question to almost every Olympian in this video, so here are their answers. Hey guys, we got Cody Miller here. What's the best advice you got for like an upcoming swimmer, maybe in high school or college, somewhere around that realm? Yo, just keep enjoying the sport. Yeah, have man. Have fun, have fun with it. All it's, right. This last, you know, only when you're young, so just have fun. Just to really find some good friends in the sport. Okay. Yeah. Set incremental goals. Incremental goals build, accumulate into big goals. Probably just stay resilient because there will be plateaus and bad days. With resilience, you will continue to grow. Love that, man. Thanks. Um, What's your best tip probably in general? start with the distractions because there'll be a lot. Okay, that's yeah. a good tip. Yeah. Thank you. High school me uh, would have appreciated some advice about just taking time to be kind to yourself and appreciate yeah. the journey and All right. know that um, you, don't, you don't always see results right away, but you like that advice. Keep working at it. Sweet. It'll, it'll pay off. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, invest in your teammates. That's what makes it fun. That's a great tip. It's, uh, that's a great tip of advice. Thank you, man. I cannot speak for the life of me, as you saw right there. <laughs> High school and college, I would just say be consistent. Be consistent. Yeah. Be All consistent right. and, and trust your coach. Sweet. Hey, it's gonna take some patience and time to, to get better. I like that advice. Yeah. What's your best advice for a high school or college swimmer? Oh, I don't really have that time today. I'm no, sorry. okay, no worries. <laughs> Uh, don't take things too seriously, you know? I yeah. like to goof off and have fun. I think that's the most important thing. When you get too serious, you get stiff, and then you don't swim well, so. Yeah, Quiet. also, I wanted to let you know, I started YouTube. That's great. One of the reasons why is because of you. Oh, right so, on, dude, thanks. Thanks Thank for you. being a great inspiration for to all of us. That. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks, that's man. Awesome. Have right a good on. one. Thank you. Yeah, nice to meet you. Yeah. My name is David Gens, if you want to check out the channel. Nice to meet you, too. Yeah, that's cool. YouTube channel. Oh, let's go. Thanks, man. Yeah, man. Going?